Hello, 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 everybody, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm the Art of Alopecia. For those who don't know me, my name is Marcy, and on this YouTube channel, we primarily do wig reviews. Wig reviews are my favorite thing in this entire world. I have been wearing wigs for nearly 13 years now. I've had alopecia since I was about seven years old, six years old, and officially started wearing wigs when I was 10, and now I am 23 years old. So I have had so many years navigating the wig world and I love doing these wig reviews because I get to help you guys kind of navigate that world as well. I'm also very active on a few other social media platforms. I have my Instagram and my TikTok. You can also find me under the name The Art of Alopecia. I also have a Gmail account that you can happily email me at theartofalopecia at gmail.com and I would be happy to connect. Alrighty, let's get right into the real reason why you clicked on this video, and that is to review yet another Tressalure synthetic wig, and this one we are going to be reviewing Undercut Bob. I'm so excited, so let's get started. So I have already posted a little sneak peek unboxing video on my Instagram that I will put right here. I have done some content with Undercut Bob before. That was a bit, that was a few months ago now. But I just received it in a new color and I haven't done a dedicated YouTube review for my own channel. I've done an Undercut Bob review for wigs.com. You could probably go find that there. But if you are interested in continuing to watch, I have a beautiful red head. Actually, I just looked on the wigs.com website, which I will list a direct link down below. This color that I'm going to be reviewing today is actually on sale. It's on clearance for $200. So be sure to take advantage of that sale. But without further ado, let's get into talking about Undercut Bob. Alrighty. If you guys are looking for a short, lightweight, red wig to rock, you might want to consider this one in the color 33-130-R4 because it is stunning. has a little bit of a darker root, but ultimately is such a beautiful cherry kind of auburn redhead. Absolutely love her. In terms of her specs, I don't have a whole lot. I know she's 15 inches in length, which is like the greatest length ever. Absolutely love her. She is super lightweight. I don't exactly know her density, but you may be able to find that on the website. In terms of her cap construction, she is your basic synthetic wig cap construction. So you have a lace front from ear tab to ear tab with a monofilament top, which basically means that you you can part the hair wherever you would like. And then we have a open machine wefted back, which is amazing for breathability for anyone living in like higher climates or even for people who are living in summer right now. We have our adjustment straps at the back that you can tighten and loosen as you please. It is a medium average cap size, so it is quite big for my head, but honestly, I make ends meet just by adjusting the straps to the tightest bit. But in terms of the ear tabs, there's some comfortable material and also the same material at the back nape. Not sure if I mentioned this, but she is also a style friendly synthetic wig, which is amazing. But be very careful with the temperature that you choose to use on this wig. I believe it's in between 275 and 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit. I'll say that one more time. Fahrenheit. So 275 to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. So honestly, this wig is great because it looks great out of the box once you get rid of the zigzag parting. You can also have some fun with some styling. So let's throw her on. And in terms of that zigzag part that I was just mentioning, that is something that a lot of people fear when they first open up their synthetic wigs. It's kind of common practice for wigs to come like that when they are made, but it is really, really super easy to fix. All you have to do is like brush it back and then kind of create your own part doing it as if it was your own hair. So taking either your finger, something sharp, or a comb. <laughs> a comb might be easier. Here she is. Oh my goodness. She is so gorgeous. Oh my goodness. 
look at that color. Look at those dimensions. Absolutely stunning. She is so lightweight, easy, breezy cover girl. <laughs> she is such a stunning, stunning, stunning piece. Oh, I just, I love Tress Allure pieces and I love their colors. They by far have the best color collection I have ever seen in a synthetic wig brand. So go check out all that Tress Allure has to offer on the wigs.com website because you will not regret it. She is such a sweet length. So she is longer at the front and then shorter at the back which is honestly kind of a fun style. Let me give you guys a side profile so you guys can kind of see. Like, look at that stunning color. And looking at it from the back, she sits very flat, though it is big. It doesn't look big on my head. Her density is pretty light so honestly this is like by far one of my favorite looks from Tress Allure. She is so gorgeous. Okay we're gonna get up close and personal to look at this hairline. The knots are pretty visible on my scalp but that's just because the roots are pretty dark and I have very fair skin but that is looking at it from a microscope like if you're just wearing your wig down like this like honestly I get so many compliments whenever I wear my Tressler wigs out either on the color um, or just like how natural the wig looks because no one would be able to tell that this is a wig. Synthetic wigs have come such a long way. In terms of the part you can part her wherever you would like. I have her parted in the middle, but you can happily part it on the left or right side. Oh, she's so stunning. The feel of this wig is really soft. It's made with honestly really high quality synthetic fibers. As I mentioned, it's light. It's airy, and if this ever happens, Tress Allure has an amazing product. It's called Wig Wax, basically a hairspray for synthetic wigs. So I definitely need to spray that so that it <laughs> stays out of my face, but that's a little trick for you guys. Also, I believe there's a promotion going on right now. If you do purchase a Tress Allure wig, you also get a free wig grip. Um, these are really great for extra security if you are feeling like your wig doesn't have enough security. But, oh, this undercut bob is so beautiful. I can't get over just like the cut, the color. She is so so freaking stunning also there is no shedding whatsoever again just like high quality synthetic fibers i am always so impressed by what tress allure puts out okay i'm gonna stop mumbling now i think i've said everything that i needed to say i would highly recommend going to check out wigs.com and going to check out specifically undercut bob but if this is not your vibe i have posted countless reviews by tress allure I've also posted a lot of content on my Instagram, so go check that out there. They just have so many beautiful options. Um, so sometimes it's hard to choose, but honestly, Undercut Bob, if you're just looking for something light and short for the summer, then I would highly, highly recommend oh she is so so gorgeous anyways go check this wig out take advantage of this sale i will have the link listed down below and we will see you next time on the art of alopecia bye guys